Disaster toilet made from recyclables. If you happen to be one who ends up out of doors, here's one sanitary solution that may help. All of the parts needed to make a portable outdoor toilet and water resistant paper holder may be lying around you. A five gallon bucket with lid is a good start. This base is the top of an old washing machine. The door off the washer top was gone, so plywood was used to fill the hole. A hole must be cut in the plywood just big enough to slide the bucket into. Make the hole for the bucket a little off center towards the back to allow for foot placement on the flat section of the washer roof top. The bucket is secured by double layers of plumber's tape and one inch wide fender washers on both sides of the one quarter by one inch bolts going through the bucket. Six bolts through the bucket and six bolts into the plywood. Four bolts hold the plywood to the washer top. The cover is plywood with a one quarter inch bolt for a handle. The hole is for ventilation. I need this for my application, but you may not need it. Any holes should be covered to keep out flies. These are covered with window screen glued on with silicone. This is the water resistant toilet paper dispenser. A one gallon container can be used. Use a wood rod, clothes hanger wire, or whatever you can find that will hold the paper roll. This post holds the paper roll container. This is the top. A bolt and washer go through the container to hold it on. A little extra pipe is left on the top for a striking point for the hammer. The bottom was narrowed to a point and welded. A hole can be placed under this toilet as deep as you desire. Our chicks were very excited to give it a try. The line forms here. A very simple rain and privacy screen can be made in this fashion. Now if you happen to be stuck out of doors, this will give you some ideas on how to make a toilet setup that your wife and kids will like better than the bushes.